in the first video in this series of tutorials directed for educators on Telescola DMT, we went through a general introduction of what is Telescola, why it is being used, and why it was created. Now we'll start going into some detail. Obviously, to submit lessons on Telescola, you will need to have a teacher account. For a teacher account, you cannot just go to the website and click register. That is for just normal users of the system, so for the general public. If you want to have access to the submit lesson functionality of Telescola, you will have to manually request an account which has a teacher access right level. If you go to the educator section, you will find these three major buttons at the very top of the page. One of them is join Telescola MT Microsoft team. The other one is request teacher access. And the, lastly, there is request support. All these buttons forward you to the same Microsoft team, but different channels. It is extremely important that you make part of the Telescola Microsoft team. This is public, anyone can join it, as long as you are obviously an educator, and request teacher access from there. If I click the Join Telescola Microsoft team, it will show me an option either if I want to download the app, if I want to use the web version, or since I have it installed already, it tells me if I want to open Microsoft Teams. Here you will find the Microsoft team for Telescola, which is called Telescola Training and Support. Please note that the Telescola Training and Support Microsoft team is split into different channels which relate to different tasks. If you want to request teacher access to Telescola so that you can submit material to the system, you have to go to the account related requests, post your name, surname and school email address so that we can create the account for you so that you can have teacher level access on Telescola. It is extremely important that you, your request includes the email address from your school. Once yeah, we receive the request, there is obviously a team of administrators backing Telescola. They will open the account for you on the Telescola system from the administration side. Um, once they open the account for you, you will receive an email on the email address you supplied directly from the Telescola system, giving you a username and a temporary system generated password which you can change uh, the first time that you log back in to the into telescola the um, once we're here um, the ms team is not only used for requesting accounts but also to report bugs in the system so if you notice something broken in the system you can report bugs over here the general support is obviously used for general support um, regarding Telescola, so issues with submitting lessons or using the system in general. And we have a new feature request channel. So if you think that there can be something, some new feature, some new function that will be beneficial to the Telescola system, obviously you can put it in here and uh, we'll review the suggestion whether to include it in the system um, or not. Please, it is extremely important that this is a very streamlined team and initiative and unless we receive requests of Microsoft Teams on this Microsoft Teams, so Telescola training and support to expedite matters um, and to maintain uh, the, the process as efficient as possible, please make sure that uh, you request your accounts from the appropriate channel, so account related request all we need is name, surname, school, and the email address, which you will be using to log in into the system. Again, just a quick reminder that the email address needs, needs to be from your school. So it needs to be a school-based email address. That is all for how to get a teacher account on Telescope MT. 
in the next uh, video we will discuss on how to actually submit a lesson to Telescola. Thank <laughs> you.